<clears throat> this is our deck area in a scaled down version so we can talk about the very important details and then you can see how they would be done. At your surface to wall intersections, <clears throat> this could be considered a high risk area because water could flow right off the edge and into the building envelope. But a trained professional is going to understand that and install a diverter like this to manage the water flow over the edge and away from the home. With new construction, we want to completely wrap the threshold six inches up the walls and from the surface up and over so the door sits on the membrane itself, providing you with a watertight finish. Okay, on an outside corner, rather than just vertically cut the membrane, a train installer is going to use 45 degree angles and have just a small section on the surface area to be welded, providing you with that watertight detail. On an inside corner, there are no cuts. Fold the material in nice and tight, take the excess material in that flap, fold it over, a nice waterproof finish. Penetrating post. Older decks often have wooden posts that penetrate the surface. These are just about impossible to waterproof. But here's a way to solve the problem. <clears throat> Wrap the membrane around the post six inches up, and then use something like this, a vinyl fence post, to slide over the top and use some vinyl trim to give you a nice finish to it. You have several choices when it comes to your choice of drip edge. <clears throat> a nice colored piece of coated drip edge like this one allows you to weld the membrane straight to the top of it, gives you a great adhesion to it and a nice look. Another choice is just a simple galvanized drip edge where you glue the membrane and wrap it over the, the drip edge and then use this clip, this PVC clip, to lock it on there nice and tight and it fastens the membrane. Another attractive way to finish off the drip edge. Another option is just to use a mechanical fastener like this L trim with color match screws and it's screwed right through the membrane mechanically attaching it in place. 